My name is Nathaniel Bowman. I am a photographer and a film editor. Why did I start film editing? I started because I was really interested in cameras for one and I was really interested in computers and what led me to that is um, I was able to create little videos in my um, in my computer which is really cool and I was 14 at the time when I found that out and I was like how do I how was I going to I was like making Lego I was making stop-motion Lego movies and those were fun to make because they took a long time but when you were done you saw it all really fast and the Legos were actually looking like they were moving on on the table by themselves and I learned a lot through through that and saw motion and also I use YouTube as a good source of like um, like copying almost but learning from them I learned a lot from YouTube um, just by the film aspect and how film progressed and then my parents got me a a little JVC camera. It was a, it was okay. It was a good qual. It was a good quality at the time when I got it, and I use that thing like to death, and it still works too. And uh, that's um and why and the why I did it um because I would love to create something people can watch and people will enjoy to watch it. That's why I started filming. When I was learning, I used Sony Vegas Movie Studios, and I went to the Pro at one point, then I went back to the normal movie studio because I was a little more simpler to learn. Just recently I just got the Adobe Cloud Service and I've been using their software. Um, I've been using Premiere Pro for using their software and that's been a really good um, experience because now I know from Sony Vegas Movie Studio I it's just come over and I can learn. There's a lot more you can do in Premiere Pro than you could in Movie Studio. It usually takes me around three hours or a couple of days to edit a video. I use a MacBook Pro and I also use a PC computer which I customize myself. I build it and it's been and that's what I've been using for like most of my videos before I got my MacBook Pro which is a little bit more portable and I take that to college with me and I'm able to make more videos with my Adobe Premiere Cloud service right now because on MacBook Pro it's a lot more it's easier to make content on a MacBook Pro when you're editing and when you're figuring out, it's a lot more easier to find out than Windows having you popping up this random message like, oh, you lost all your footage and then you gotta find it again. Which is not, not saying Windows PCs are bad, I'm saying that they both have their weakness and their um, strong suits of what they do. I use a Sennheiser wireless microphone. It's connected to my, my, my camera right now and you're hearing right now. It's a little older than the, than the other ones, but it's working great and I think that's what I'm going to be using. I also do a lot of computer coding. I do a lot of computer programming on the computer. So I do like to get into like maybe that to be a side job or this to be a good hobby to do and to create good content video just for maybe you the viewer that is watching and maybe you just maybe just for more fun for me to make better content for you guys. How do I start planning my videos? Usually I start planning my videos. I usually write them down. I usually write questions what I want to ask for or even shoot anything because it's better to write something down and have it down pat and you just go off that than having just to go there and shoot something because then it's like ill prepared and like you don't know what's going to go happen because you don't have something to go go by a list or something make a list of shots you want make a list of scripts you want what the character wants to do it's writing your own like story writing your own like um scenes writing your own stuff on a piece of paper will help you learn like well if you get those shots you want and then you just edit with that edit with the shots you have on a piece of paper because then that will then you can move it around you can switch it up you can make something story wise because editing wise you can make anything in editing you can cut it to where you want it cut it to where you move it around um, make it longer make it shorter but what you really want to do is write it down first then do it for me I like to write it down and start out of it why do I make videos? I like to make things that people will enjoy to watch.